reef. Is that what I'm driving? Mm. Whoa, nice car, man. Yeah, it gets me from A to B. with Hank, Buffalo's number one police dog, on the job. This is Phil Seidelman reporting from the Police Canine Training Center, Channel 5 News. And cut it. Hey, look what the cat coughed up. Channel 7, right? You're the guy that went crazy. I had a bad moment. Well, what are you doing here? Just looking for a story? There's no story here. This pond is all fished out. Standard stuff anyway. I don't know. My instinct tells me there's something more. Yeah, we'll go with that. It served you well in the past, right? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Hank found something. Yes. Hey, we got a body! Get the camera! Now! Oh, the keys are inside! I guess every dog has his day. Hey, kid, you want to make 10 bucks? Sure. You know how to use one of these things? Duh. <laughs> Seems to be in tune. Let's do this. The body of Jimmy Hoffa was uncovered in a field today outside of a canine training center in Buffalo, New York. Bruce Nolan was the first on the scene. Thank you, Jane. As you can see behind us, the body is being carefully exhumed and will be transported to a medical facility where DNA testing can confirm the identity. That, however, merely a formality at this point, as in a bizarre twist, the body was found buried with a birth certificate and complete set of dental records. I'd call that a red letter day for any canine unit, but was that enough for old Hank here? No siree. Moments later, he busted a local news camera crew with 220 pounds of marijuana. I never saw it before! I swear! <laughs> I'm Bruce Nolan, and that's the way the cookie grows.